first day after 2013 ended. Hamburg's police commissioner alleged that the police had been besieged by black hooded kinds of people throwing bricks and flares through the glass of San Pauli headquarters, which is now partly burned down. As defense responds, the police defined the Hamburg districts, Altona, San Georg, San Pauli, and Sternschanze as Gefahrengebiete, danger zones, <coughs> which legalized the police to identify and search any person without needing any cause of suspicion. How be it? Black hoodies, piercings, and shades have been predominantly picked and physically seized with no explanation at all. And 2014 was four days young when the TV showed white helmeted police officers in full panoply searching a black hooded citizen for bricks, batons, or flares. But all they found in his black jogging pants was a nice, white, clean, new brush. <laughs> Nothing more. And this clip ignited our revolution. The Lou Brush Revolution. On the 11th of January, we, 30-ish black hoodies, raided every drugstore's stock of loo brushes into our rucksacks and bags for our first brush mop. In the danger zones on Pauli, we spread it out, blended into the crowd of ordinary innocent citizen. And at 1600, when the San Pauli church bell rang, we all drew these like, white loo brushes and held them up to the sky like Highlander receiving his immortal power. It looked like this. <laughs> Freeze frame. <laughs> Pedestrians confused. We chant. our loo brushes as microphones and we drummed on every hollow object and we brushed posters of light posts and we juggled them high into the sky we used them as broomsticks nimbus 2000 we brushed our teeth we scratched our backs and we picked our noses and we picked our ears yeah. until one used it like a grenade or like a brick like a flare. And 55 seconds later, panoplied police and horsed forces raged into our derisable protest, snapping our bodies like a car cracking weed in fields, twisting shoulders, elbows, and knees, truncheoning skulls and bones, shooting high voltage into our bodies, pepper spraying eyes, handcuffing wrists. Five were hospitalized. And two still have to wake up. And all that was left in San Pauli were white loo brushes. Some still shrink wrapped, some dotted rusty red. And these drops of blood will spread like measles on the police's skin. Everyone itching, itching, itching. And I will scratch these spots with the bristles of my used loo brush. <laughs>